you wouldn't believe how many people were dumbfounded by the fact that I am starting a YouTube channel. The conversation would go something like this. Yeah, no, I'm starting a YouTube channel. I started about two months ago, but yeah, it's going really well. You started a YouTube channel now? Like in 2021? Don't you think that's a little too late? Uh, I understand completely where they're coming from. I get it. YouTube is kind of an old company now. It's not young anymore. And isn't it a little oversaturated with the content creators? So I just wanted to make a video just to put those questions at rest. And maybe even some of you wanted to start a YouTube channel, but you were thinking the same thing. Am I, am I too late to the game? I just want to tell you that you are absolutely not late at all. And if anything, this is the best time ever to start a YouTube channel. So let's just start with the user base, okay? Every single month, YouTube has two plus billion users get on the site. Two billion. And I'm not just going to skate by that. That's like a quarter of the planet getting on YouTube every single month. I mean, just imagine if you captured 0.001% of that. That's still 20,000 views you're getting per month. So I think it's obvious to say that the size of YouTube is pretty compelling. But that's not the best part. For content creators specifically, YouTube has an ad revenue every quarter of $7 billion. And I know what you might be thinking, you're like, who cares, YouTube is big and they get a lot of money, but why does that matter for me as a potential content creator? It's because YouTube shares that money with their content creators. In fact, YouTube actually pays out their content creators more than any other site and it's not even close. So it's safe to say that YouTube is just absolutely massive. But the best part is that it's free. It's a perfect symbiotic relationship between content creator and viewer. It's completely free for you as a content creator to post on the website, and it's also free for the viewer to digest that content. Now this is a beautifully harmonious relationship between the content creator and the viewer because it doesn't cost you anything as a content creator to post on the website, but it also doesn't cost the viewer any money to see the video. Now this is really wonderful because you're not trying to get money out of the viewer's pocket like a commercial would be. Not at all. This is more you're trying to get the viewer just to watch your video and YouTube is going to pay you the money. Now this sets up a fantastic dynamic being a creator. They incentivize views. So you're simply just trying to get the most eyes on your content. And the best way to do that is to make quality content. It's not about the money anymore. You're providing value to your viewers by providing something of substance. Maybe you teach them something or just entertain them. But regardless what it is, you're providing better content for the user base. Not only that, but YouTube is now a fantastic outlet for beginner content creators to get into bigger markets if they choose to. What I mean by that is if you want to be a filmmaker, for instance, you don't have to go to school for four years and try to get in at a production company. Not at all. You can make cinematic YouTube videos and have people notice you that way. I mean, what's better credentials than having millions of views on YouTube for something that you created? If you want to get into animation, you don't have to get a job in an animation studio anymore. You can practice on your own time and make YouTube videos of the animations. I mean, there's truly endless YouTube channel ideas that you can choose from. And it's just a fantastic thing conceptually to have a platform free to use that anyone across the world can see your content with just a click of a button. If you have a genuine message that you want to share or you want to teach something that's close to your heart, you can do that. And it's not even that difficult. And I know what you're thinking. Yeah, sure, it's easy to make it, but how do you get people onto the video? In comes the YouTube algorithm. Yes, my second main point in why it's not too late to starting a YouTube channel is the YouTube algorithm. The not so secret sauce of YouTube. Look, I probably don't have to explain to you that the YouTube algorithm is amazing. I mean, you go on your homepage and you see the recommended videos that YouTube gives you and they're usually pretty spot on. And I'm more than happy to click on a new YouTube channel because now it opens up an entire new world of potentially really good content. Yeah, the YouTube algorithm reigns supreme. It's really well done because the more videos you like and subscribe to, the more content like that person or like that content is recommended to you. Here, give it a shot. Go down below and click the like button and subscribe to my channel to see more things like it. Was that smooth? Okay, but beyond my video, like all the videos that you truly do like watching on YouTube because the YouTube algorithm, you gotta feed it and it's only gonna help your recommendations in the long run. I just started YouTube about two months ago upon filming this and I already have 200 subscribers. Now it's important to note that I didn't market this at all. I post the video and I just let YouTube do its thing. If done right and you have a great thumbnail and a title and it sparks interest or intrigue, then YouTube is going to start recommending this video out to absolutely anyone that likes the content like it. 
Now this is huge because you don't have to spend money on marketing or do any of that. I'm of the full belief you don't even need social media. You can just post on YouTube and that's it, you're done. Let YouTube do its thing. But my last point goes a little bit deeper. Now it's fair to say, I love YouTube. I watch multiple videos a day, I've learned a ton, and I've bettered myself as a person through these videos. I've found content that truly makes me laugh and smile, and I've also found content that's super heartwarming and inspiring. Because just for a moment, I get to capture your attention. I control your experience for just a few minutes every day. Maybe you've had a bad day, maybe you got fired from your job, maybe your car broke down, maybe you got your heart broken. But YouTube is just a wonderful escape, just for a moment, away from your life. YouTube can be a glimpse into someone's life that you've never seen before. It can be an idea you've never thought of. It can be knowledge to help you in your everyday life. It can be anything you want it to be, and that's why you should go out and start a YouTube channel. If you have content that you've always wanted to make, there's nothing stopping you. Everything from YouTube is at your disposal. The hardest thing to do, and really all it takes, is hitting record. Make this life and what you have of it everything you want it to be. You have the ability to help out others maybe in a similar situation as yourself right now. If you had thousands of eyes on you and all their ears ready to listen, what would you say? Well, now you have that ability and that opportunity through YouTube. So no, in 2021 and beyond, it's not too late to start a YouTube channel. It's not nearly as hard as you think it is, and it is a blast doing it. Take it upon yourself and make something truly great. You'll feel better that you did it, and worst case, no one's watching. I hope this helps some of you, and if it does, consider subscribing and liking the video. It helps me out a lot and tells me I'm doing a good job. Thank you so much for your time, and please, create something beautiful.